The topic of discussion is elasticity of demand. So what do we mean by elasticity of demand? As Dulé defined it, the elasticity of demand measures the responsiveness of the quantity demanded in a good to change in its price, prices of other goods and changes in consumer's income. So therefore, elasticity of demand is the quantum change in the quantity demanded due to change in either of the above components that is price, price of other goods or consumer's income. What are the kinds of elasticity of demand? First is the price elasticity of demand. It implies that what is the change in quantity demanded due to change in the price of the commodity. Second is the income elasticity of demand. It is the change in quantity demanded due to change in consumer's income. Lastly, we have the cross elasticity of demand. It is the change in quantity demanded due to change in prices of other goods. As per the class 12th curriculum, we will only discuss the price elasticity of demand. How do we measure the price elasticity of demand? First method is the total expenditure method which was proposed by Marshall. It shows us the effect on the consumer's total expenditure due to change in price, maintaining the relationship between price and quantity to be the same. So, if with decrease in price, expenditure is constant, then elasticity is equal to 1. With decrease in price, expenditure increases, then elasticity is greater than 1. And with decrease in price, expenditure also decreases, then elasticity is less than 1. Second method we have is the proportionate or percentage method which was also suggested by Marshall. It is calculated using the formula that is proportionate change in quantity demanded divided by the proportionate change in price. Lastly we have is the geometric method. It is also known as the point method of measuring elasticity of demand. It is thus calculated as the ratio of lower segment to the upper segment. Diagrammatically, point on x-axis shows us elasticity equals to zero and on y-axis implies elasticity equals to infinity. The midpoint on the curve implies elasticity equals to one. What are the degrees of price elasticity of demand? In case of perfectly elastic demand, elasticity is equal to infinity. So our curve is a horizontal line parallel to x-axis. And in case of perfectly inelastic demand, elasticity equals to zero. So our curve is a vertical line parallel to y-axis. At times, we have a curve of the shape rectangular hyperbola. It depicts that elasticity equals to 1 at all points on the curve. So what are the factors which determine price elasticity? First is the nature of a commodity. If the commodity is a necessity, elasticity is less than 1. And if it is a luxury, then elasticity is greater than 1. Second is the availability of substitutes. If substitutes are available, the demand is elastic and vice versa. Third is the different uses of a commodity. If the commodity has many uses, then the demand is elastic. Fourth is the postponement of the use of the commodity. If the consumption of that commodity can be postponed, then we have an elastic demand and vice versa. Fifth we have is the income of the consumer. If the income is very high, then demand is inelastic. And if income is very low, then also we have an inelastic demand. Sixth is the habit of the consumer. If the person is habitual to a commodity, then demand is inelastic. Seventh is the proportionate of income spent on a commodity. If the consumer spends a small proportion of the income on a commodity, then the demand is inelastic and vice versa. Eighth is the price level. 
If the price level is high in the economy, then the demand is highly elastic and vice versa. Lastly, we have is the time period. If the time period of the consumption is short, then the demand is inelastic and if we have a long time period, then the demand is elastic. So this was the brief introduction about the elasticity of demand. If you have any more questions, feel free to contact us. You may visit our website www.economicsharbor.com or email us at admin at the rate economicsharbor.com. Thank you and take care.